Welcome to the segment of Voice of Love. In this channel, this segment of Voice of Love will be purely in English. I'm reading to you an email from a lady. The title of that email is Mixed Signals of a Boyfriend. He first said he wanted to take a break to be with himself because he had some issues. Then three weeks later, he broke up with me. I was really sad, but I managed to remain calm. But a week later, the, he, the breakup was really hurting me so much. But then he started calling me again and wanted to always hang out with me. I went along because I was emotionally too dependent on him. As days went by, I grew uncomfortable because I knew that even though we were like a couple, he still didn't consider me his girlfriend. I, decide, I decided to speak to him about it, and he told me that he was still having some issues and that if I wanted to, too, I could be with him because in the future we will get back together. Again, I went along with what he said, hoping that we will get back together soon. But then I noticed a repeated cycle taking place. For some days, he would keep calling me and wanting to spend time with me, and then suddenly he won't answer my calls or tell me to hang out with him. After that again, he would come back, and this started to frustrate me. Last month, I decided that it was enough, and I spoke to him. I told him to either be with me or without me, and that if he decided to be without me, then we should stop seeing each other completely so that I can move on. He then told me that he didn't know that something was wrong. Wow. He said that we should be friends for now, and we don't know what might happen in the future. He even said that he didn't want to stop talking to me completely because he didn't want to lose me. Since then, I have been distant with him. I never call or text him, and even when he calls or comes around, I don't say much. Thankfully, I'm no longer emotionally dependent on him, and I have decided to focus on myself. But since we are in the same college, I get to meet him very often. And that time, he has his way to show that he still cares about me. He will come and give me a long hug. He will try and play with me like he used to do. When we are talking, he wouldn't take his eyes off me. And if he is free, he will want to meet me. I know that I should focus on myself and not on what he's doing, but all this gives me a slight hope that we will get back together. I have accepted that it's over, but I keep wondering whether he sees me just as a friend or he misses our relationship. Or maybe he just misses me being with him all the time because he has told me that he misses me. This time, I don't want to be given hope and then get hurt again. I don't know if I should completely ignore him or should I let things be the way they are. I am so confused now. I would really appreciate if you could help me. Listen, there are many ladies like this one who are suffering in their relationship. They really, everyone, everyone wants to be loved. Everyone wants to be taken care of. Everyone needs to have somebody close to him. So no matter how much you love somebody, no, much, no matter how much you care about somebody, if he doesn't work hard to make you feel loved, he's not worthy of your time. Listen to me. You need to learn to love yourself. If you can't love yourself, people will play with your feelings 
and break your heart. So be strong enough to say, well, if you don't be helped this way, please, I'm not a doll to be played with. So you need to be strong enough to be able to show your muscles that you can live on your own. This person, you just met him maybe for two or three years, you need to remember that he has got his own life, got your own life. But if he doesn't contribute to your happiness and your peace of mind, tell him to fuck off. He's not worthy of your time at all. Be yourself and love yourself, and this will bring happiness to your soul. May God bless you and take care of your good self.